Yo, what's going on guys? How are y'all doing? Welcome back for another video. It's been a while since I've posted and I know that the last video was the Cars and Coffee video, but today we've got something very special. We have, as you guys can tell by the title, the iPhone 10 unboxing. Today is the very first day that you are able to have the iPhone 10. When it came out for pre-ordering, in 10 minutes if you did not have it, you would have to wait five weeks versus getting it today. So luckily, we got this thing in the first 10 minutes. So I'm gonna get an unboxing out for you guys a little bit earlier than most people will. So let's get right to it. All right, wow, that was quite simple. I was expecting a little bit more to that. Wow, that thing is really protected in there. over there we'll need that right now hopefully it's like shrunk onto the box so it's like the corners are right there I'm gonna throw this over to the side all right this is the iPhone 10 box that's pretty dope and guys a lot of the videos you're seeing on YouTube are clones and stuff like that this is not a clone this is the legitimate Apple iPhone 10 not a clone just 100% real. So, we're gonna go ahead and undo this. It always feels so good to have a brand new iPhone and peel that off. And they did that completely different this time though. Like usually you have to like cut around it, but it's actually nicer that way. Here we go. There it is. The iPhone 10 in space gray, I believe it is. It's 256 gig. This thing is beautiful. Let me take this thing out. Wow. That is so nice. I just wanted to look at it for myself there for a second, but here's the screen. As you see, no home button on the bottom there. And then at the top, you see the little notch. So I'm gonna, actually, I'm gonna leave the plastic on for now. And then you've got the vertical camera, no longer horizontal, it's vertical. And that's kind of nice. Now one thing I will say about the camera is it's not like the seven camera where it slopes up, it's more like the uh, six and 6S camera where it like, um, just goes straight up. And then, I guess you guys can maybe see there, and uh, also, it stands up taller than the 6 and 6S camera, I believe. And if I'm right about that, I don't know how much taller. I just, just by looking at it now, I think it does stand up taller. Anyways, guys, speaking of the camera, it has a 12 megapixel front and back camera. It can do uh, 4K at 60 frames per second and 1080p at 240, I believe. And 240 frames per second. So, uh, yeah, and it's got no writing on the back, which I absolutely love because it doesn't look like you got like serial numbers and stuff like that on the back. All you see is iPhone and then a nice, beautiful looking Apple logo right there. Now, I'm sorry, but I don't want to take this thing out of the plastic yet. I think I'm going to leave this in there for a little bit, guys. I might have another video on the channel talking about like a 24 hour review, but um, I like this thing a lot. All right, guys, now we're going to take a nice quick look inside the box. So here are the Apple headphones that come with every iPhone. I've heard rumors that these are actually changed up a little bit, but they don't appear to be. They look the same. Yeah, they're, they're the same. <laughs> At least as far as I can tell cosmetically, they appear to be the same. Whoops, I'll fix that later. And uh, as you guys can see, you got the lightning cable there because there's no headphone jack like there used to be, which I miss and I'll never get over that. Actually, I'm not going to undo these quite yet. I like to save some stuff, you know? That's what I like to do. I like to save some stuff. Anyways, we're going to put these to this side for now. And then in here, you've got the charger. I like the way they got that nice and around. It looks cool. But um, it's just, you know, your standard lightning cable. That's nothing new. Charger brick, nothing new. Oh, I thought these ones had something to do. I guess not. All right, guys, so let's go back to this nice, beautiful iPhone 10. We're going to go ahead and take the nice wrap off of that. 
This is like the best part of the unboxing. Everyone knows it. Gotta savor that moment. And put that over to the side. So here's the nice clear screen. Now we're gonna power this thing on. Alright. There we go. It's coming on. There we go. Hello. It's so refreshing to see how clear that screen is. So I'm not gonna go through the setup process because I mean, everyone knows what the setup process is. There's no point in it. But I do wanna talk about a few things. So as you guys can see, this iPhone has a little notch right there. That notch will sometimes get in the way of your YouTube videos if you watch them like this, like you should be. Because if you're not, then you're not from Earth, apparently. <laughs> but uh, if you watch them like this, it will get in the way. The notch will. And, uh... Oh. Force of habit. My gosh. I'm never going to get used to that. Not doing that until, like, three months of this thing. But, uh... That, that just looks so futuristic. I can't get over how cool that looks. It's just... It's like the whole screen is just phone. I love it. But um, now one thing I do want to mention, this kind of surprised me when I first saw the uh, pictures of the phone when they announced it. The fact that it has the screen with the uh, black lines all the way, or black line all the way around it, instead of the screen kind of sloping off more, like with the actual part that lights up sloping off more, because I would figure they'd want to go for that with the more futuristic look, but like I said, this still looks very, very futuristic as it is. So that's it for this review, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and have a nice day. Peace.